how to add integer field inside attribute table and the basic knowledge of data type say what is precision what is length so this lecture is going to be very interesting let's start the class now let's create another field with integer value now right here integer now click ok we can input only digit value we can't input here text can you see that if I type a b c d it will not accept my entered value if I type 1 2 3 4 now press enter it accept my entry now let's see another data type which is maximum usable decimal you can write another name also say I want to use Sharia D in our GIS project maximum type we need this type of field decimal number real in decimal number real we have two types of issue one is length which we already know in our text field and another one is precision now let's see what is the difference between length and precision as we already know length means the total digit length of data in here I want to give the length of this decimal number value will be 10 which means the maximum digit length will be 10 I can input only 10 digit number inside this field in total and what is precision in decimal number precision means the total digit value on the right side after dot say if I give the precision is 4 which means the total data digit length will be 10 and after dot on the right side I can input maximum four digit now let's make a test our length is 10 and precision is 4 so we can input only four digit on the right side after dot in my data value if we click ok now let's make a test in here my total length is 10 so on the left side of dot maximum I can input six digit and as I have created the precision 4 after dot I can input only 4 digit I can't input more than 4 after this dotted and as the total length of this data value is 10 so on the left side I can input rest of 6 digit so the whole number length is total length and after dot the digit length is known as precision so I hope now you have understand the difference between precision and length this is the length and this is precision now let's play with this interesting game inside your attribute table of QGIS interface till then enjoy GIS thank you